Right, breaking overnight, police in northern Kanawha County are now searching after a home is hit by a car. Hannah Getz is following this story for us. She joins us live now with the latest. Hannah? Jack and Marilee, Mr. and Mrs. Hoy have lived in this home since 1973, and they haven't seen an issue in all those years until tonight where a car drove through the yard and crashed right into their home here in Sissonville. Now you can see where that damage is at that bay window, and you can see the track marks right here coming through their neighbor's yard, taking out the mailbox, taking out some of the, the poles here from the fence and going through that front window. Now just a few feet to the right of that, you can see their bedroom window where they were sound asleep when they heard an engine revving up and then a car crashing through their home. Now you can see there's multiple track marks here in the yard where the car was skidding around and then took out part of Mr. Hoy's car over there. Wrecked into that, you can see the mud splattered, pushed that to the side and then the driver did flee the scene. Now police are still searching for the driver. Mr. Hoy tells us that police told him that they have the truck, but the driver took off on foot. So we're still waiting to get some updates from that. But luckily, no injuries for either of the Hoy of the Hoys here. Um, both of their kids are grown up, moved out of the house here. So it was just the two of them sleeping. Uh, they say somebody was looking over them tonight as they received no injuries, but extensive damage there inside the home. Mr. Hoy also said that he built on on that whole front porch there as well as an addition to the home off to the side so it's upsetting to him to see all of his hard work throughout the years destroyed and he's hoping that whoever did this uh, has to end up paying for it in the end but we'll keep you updated with the very latest reporting live in Sissonville I'm Hannah gets 13 news working for you